Sammy, Duris will be at this shop. Come on, come on. Ella. Marcos to come down here himself, if he wants his money, huh? Uh, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. You should have thought of that when you borrowed drachmi, Duris. But my family... It's hot. I'm in a bad mood. And you're going to pay. We both know it. The question is, what do I break first? You or your merchandise? You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to, to, to a mercenary or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. You're right about that. Forget the drag me. Marcos and I need to have a talk. You're letting me go? Then at least take this sword. Nothing special, but it's better than that rusty one you've got. With the Cyclops involved, I'll need it. You better set Marcos straight or you're both dead. Until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mystios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good. Or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Alexios, I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. It'll take a lot of work. And even then, I'm not sure. 
We have no option but to try. Then you'd better be willing to help. I won't do all the dirty work. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh! Ha! You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! Kefalonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a Mystheos with a Havel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you. How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can. Why, I was just filling my friend Alexios in on the details. He already has a plan to deal with these bandits. He's the silent but deadly type. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Alexios, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. These bows will make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? War's brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small-time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies! <laughs> 